A 1600 mile race is making its way through the tri state this week. Yeah, we got to actually see them take off at the beginning of the show. The old glory relay leaving Ohio, heading now into Kentucky. And our Taylor Davis joins us live now with the meaning behind that race. That's right. The first crew has already left and the meaning is about one single flag that travels across six states. And today, like you said, they're going to Kentucky. Now joining me here is John with the red, white and blue organization who's been doing this for 10 years now. Talk about the importance of today. This relay, I think there's so much negativity in our country right now, and this relay, I think, is an example of something really positive that a group of people, especially veterans, can do. You know, to, to really just like show people that we're capable of really important and big things and the power of the veteran community. And talk about the process. Now they're out on the trail, the first crew. Talk about how they're going to transport that flag from one another. The way the relay works is every day there's a start point and end point. We have a leg captain who's in charge of picking the route in the safest way to get there and, and divvying it up with the different participants. So there's a series of people. They're going to, some will walk, some will run, some will cycle. And we got to get the flag to Carrollton, Kentucky, to the American Legion post there by the end of the day. And we got to do it safely. So, you know, someone will take the flag and hand it off to the next person and keep moving. And then there's a party. There's a party. There's always a party at the end of the day. It, this is hard, you know, getting getting the flag from point A to B, point B is a lot of work. And we want to celebrate the participants at the end of the night. And how many people will be joining in today? We saw some of them leave. I think probably 20 or 30 people will be involved today in some form or fashion getting the flag up there. And that's a pretty typical day for us. And then what's your next stop? After Carrollton, we're going to head into Louisville, Kentucky. So we'll be there tonight. This th we take no days off on this thing. So we'll start again at daylight tomorrow morning and we'll get it into Louisville in Derby week. So we've got to get ready for that. All righty, a bunch of fun. Thank you so much, John. And like he said, the flag is going to continue to travel and so many more people are going to continue to join in. Taylor Davis, Fox 19 Now.